Hello everyone, welcome back to the Stealth Praxium in StarCraft II, Wings of Liberty. And remember, last time, we purified the colony, so we sided with the Protoss against Ariel. And, well, if you don't know what happens when you do that, watch the last video and you'll see that this chick doesn't remain as nice looking as normal. So you know what? We're going to side with Ariel this time and fight off the Protoss. I ain't gonna stand by while you wipe out a whole colony, Solendus. Not while there's still a chance we can save them. Then it shall be an honor to meet you on the field of battle. Your reputation as a commander is most impressive. I trust you will live up to it. Thank you, Jim. Thank you so much. Whatever's happening on Haven, my people don't deserve to be wiped out. We'll make this right. I'll find a cure. I don't think you will, but, you know, it's good to be positive. Jim, the Protoss are already closing in on the colony. My people don't stand a chance. We're gonna have to stop that purifier of theirs before it can wipe the whole place out. Get everyone evacuated to the main base area. If the purifier gets that far, we're done. Or at least we can count on them being methodical. They'll stop to burn every settlement along the way. You sure know how to pick a fight, cowboy. I got something that'll help you. I called in some favorites and got us Viking schematics. Again. Remember, they can change from a jet into a combat walker and back again. Pretty nifty stuff. Jim, the purifier's drawing power from several Protoss Nexus. Its shields are completely impenetrable. How can you stop something like that? Easy. We knock out those Nexi first, then we take down the purifier. Don't worry, Ariel. We'll stop them. I mean, Jim Rayner does know a lot about the Protoss. Like, I don't know if you guys have played the first StarCraft or Brood War. He's usually with them, helping kill the Zerg. Or the other Terrans, which at that time were called the Confederacy. You can build two Vikings at a time if you attach a reactor add-on to your starport. Or, if you're like me and got the tech reactor upgrade, that's even better. That means you can build two battle cruisers at the same time. As long as you have a, you know, fusion core. But that's not important. Hmm, Haven kind of looks like Earth. I think I said that last time, but it needs to be said again. Come on, game, you can do it. I believe in you. I believe! No? Yes. Good. Big job! Bad news? Yep! I've located the Protoss Nexuses that are channeling power to the Purifier shields. We'll have to destroy them before we can stop the Purifier. Okay, so we've got Vikings again. That's fantastic. I want a tech reactor on that. Uh... Some of the colonists didn't make it to our base in time. We should be ready to assist them when the Protoss attack. We will be, don't worry. Can we get to this one in time? No, oh, I'm fine. I don't need to lower my graphics. It's fine. Uh, we can't get any mercenaries right now. Let's get some more of these. Let's get these automated Vespine refineries up and running. Let's get that. Started there. Excellent. Uh, look that. What's this? A command biodome. That looks awesome. You guys actually gonna do anything or just kind of no? Add on complete. Come on, guys, let's go. The army marches and not not really marches. It flies. We can't afford another one yet. That's a shame. Almost, almost. Now, there we go. Almost two at one time. More SCVs. Another mule. This better be good. Let's get down to that base down there. Sir, the purifier has arrived and is on the move. Can't wait. Uh, it's just it's actually just here. It's not actually oh now 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 it's moving. Ready. Now it's moving. Can I get there in time to evacuate? How do I how do I do that? Go ahead. SCV, you get back to work. Let's get some more Vikings. Not enough minerals. Sorry. SCV ready. There's no one here, luckily, I think. Armed 
Man. I just want an air army navy. Another Viking. Okay, that's that upgrade. I need an armory. Actually, I need more supply depots. You're right, game. The purifier's coming into range of a colony base. It's it's abandoned. I'm pretty sure there's nothing here. Additional supply depots required. I'm dropping supply depots. Don't worry. Guys, just kill the sentry. Destroy the Protoss Nexus. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's just march into a Protoss base. I'm sure this won't end badly, right? Right? Commencing. Let's get a tech reactor here. SCV ready. More SCVs. Another mule. They can't get over there, can they? Transmit orders. What is shooting me? Shoot the stalkers. Okay. Shoot the stalkers before dying to the Colossus, possibly. Fly. Nope. Too many stalkers. Fall back. Very nice, but there's no actual colonists here, so it's fine. Uh, Add on complete. Wraiths? I don't have banshees yet, so it has to be a wraith, apparently. More of those. Okay, that, that, we'll, we'll just shake that one off. We'll shake off that defeat. Uh, da -da. Let's get these guys to rally to her. To some marine marauder going. Need some triage? That's fine. Okay. Sir, I'm detecting a massive energy spike. The purifier is about to fire. Yes, but luckily there's no humans there. Just a bunch of pro uh just a bunch of buildings actually. Let's get this starport. Yes, sir. I kind of want two of them. Can we get this starport churning out more things? Like these wraiths? That's great. Boom. The waiting orders. Okay. Oh my. That's unfortunate. What? They can warp in carriers? I call bullshit. I want... I want a mothership. One, that, that's, that's that big. And two, can warp in carriers. No one could beat me. Commander, a Protoss squadron is going after the colony ships. Those people don't stand a chance unless we stop it. We're going, we're going. Out of your ship. Um, hmm. Ready to blunder. Go, go, go! Where are you guys? Oh, it's a terror fleet. Let's add these guys Ready to the terror fleet. Battle. Commencing. You see no wraiths. No wraiths at all. There goes one carrier. Carrier might want to launch the uh, interceptors or something. I don't know. Thanks, Rainers Raiders. We're getting out of here. Good idea. The colonists have evacuated the first settlement in the purifier's path. Okay, guys, you can decloak. The colonists left some resources behind after they evacuated. We should pick them up. We're going to, don't worry. <laughs> now we're going to get another tech reactor. And we're actually overcounted on that. Fuck it. More mules. Nope, never mind. Can't have more mules. But I can have a shit ton of supply depots. Base is under attack. By what? Oh. A stalker. Okay. Two stalkers. Okay, well, that that will be dealt with accordingly. Just give it time. 
We really need to crush these Nexus right now. Or I can't defeat the Protoss. Uh... More Vikings. More Wraiths. Some of that. Yeah. Get one of those. Add there we on. go. Complete. Another... Surely you guys have got this. There are way more of you than there are of them. Whoa. Oh, that mouse lag for now. Okay. You can keep on building these things. I know they have a name, I just don't care right now. Drop all the supply depots. Okay. We're all going this way. Commencing. Transformation systems primed. Rate the waiting orders. Actually, we're gonna stop right here. Reporting Cloak in. the Banshees. I mean, not the Banshees, Corp. the Wraiths. Go ahead, command. I don't think they have any. Light them up. That's unfortunate. No warp prism, that is, that is. The Protoss have arrived at another settlement, sir. Yeah, but it's empty. Drop the Vikings! Rate the waiting orders. You guys should probably focus on the Colossus. There you go. Man, look at my wall of supply depot. This is the great wall of supply depot. Let's see, let's get some more Vikings. And some more Wraiths. Oh good, you actually destroyed one. That's one Nexus down. Keep at it, boys. We gotta stop that ship. We're going, we're going. Just got off to a bit of a slow start. This is my navy. Actually, let's not set down right in front of the Nexus. We don't know what's there. Um hmm. Cloak the wraiths and send them on an attack mission. Oh, that phoenix is screwed. Okay, guys, everyone, deploy, deploy! That phoenix can't attack my ground forces because phoenix can't shoot the ground. Oh, someone heal this viking, please. Oh, uh, here we go. The fleet arrives. Okay, I wish I had a battle cruiser, but I guess I can do without one. More wraiths. And I don't have enough to get more of those. Another Nexus gone. Great work. Don't give them a chance to regroup. You guys are terrible. Uncloak. We're going. The army marches again. Hmm. More Vikings. Yes. Energy output is peaking. The Protoss are going to destroy the second colony base. I never made that armory, did I? Insufficient Vespine gas. Order. Yeah, but there's no one there, so it's fine. Let's get an armory. We hear you. Then you guys can go back to work. They're all over me. Not enough energy. Cloak! You stupid wraiths! Fall back! Mineral field depleted. Very well. Can't hold them alone. Oh! You stupid Vikings, you're just dying! Kill the carrier! Cloak! You guys are terrible! More Vikings! Insufficient Vespine gas. Fine, more Vikings! Warning. Protoss squadron detected approaching colonist settlement. Ah, 
That's a that's a carrier. Focus on the carrier. Our allies are being attacked. Okay, come on, kill this carrier. Can you guys take this Nexus by yourself? I think you can. Our ship's gonna burn up! The Protoss are killing us! No, they those interceptors do not do a lot of damage. You're fine. Ready to blunder. Uh hmm. More wraiths. Yeah, no, you're fine. My Vikings got here in time. No problem. The colonists have successfully evacuated that settlement. Just go pick up all the loot. Can't hold them alone. No one lives forever. Purifier shields are offline, sir. Hit it now. Uh, first we need to, we need to drive away. I mean, I need to fly away. You guys can decloak. Save your energy. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. There's some probes here. Don't let them live. Nail them. Nail them to the wall. You guys go that way. More wraiths. More Vikings. More Vikings. More wraiths. More everything. Where are you going, Purifier? Oh. See, the last time I played this mission... The first time I played this campaign, I actually let them get, like, on the approach to my base, and I just built anti-air turrets everywhere. But first, we're gonna gather the fleet, and then we're gonna go stomp some Protoss. I know, it's kinda sad, I love Protoss, but it has to be done. Man, these science vessels are slow. Not as slow as this purifier. How fast do you go? Oh, you know, 0.4. Okay, yep. Two. Okay, yep. I understand. Fleet, move out! There we go. More Vikings! Excellent. You know what? Let's let's bring all branches of the um, military into this. Let's bring the army. You know what? Let's get ship weapons level 1, finally. They've almost reached the next base. Hurry! Oh, it's fine, honey. Cloaking the race! sent our units into a dimensional warp field. The effect should only be temporary, though. Oh, that's fine. Because my fleet is here. It, it, it will pop out of that field and blow the f*** out of that purifier. Come on! Ready to blunder. I'll be cloaking that. Ready to blunder. Pretty sure I'll win this. These Phoenix have got nothing on me. There you go! Concentrate forward firepower! Oh, just look at this barrage. Okay, so the Marauder did die. It doesn't matter, it's over. Yep. Protoss are retreating! You've done it! Oh no! Poor Selendis! You are as cunning as the stories say, James Raynor. I hope your belief in these colonists will be vindicated. I love it. You kill like half the Protoss and they're like, hey, you're that good of a general. That's okay. That was a short mission. Safe haven. Save three colonist outposts. Oh, cool. I did it. You shall not pass. Awesome. Well, that time, guys, we saved the colonists instead of, you know, burning them from Haven, which is probably the smarter thing to do, actually. Hyperion Airlock 36, 1422, shipboard time. So I guess this is goodbye, Doc. Now you've got a lot of cleaning up to do out there. We'll manage somehow. I just hope you boys stay out of trouble. Those Protoss are bound to be upset. Well, me and the Protoss go way back. I've helped them out a few times. Figure they might cut me some slack.
You know, you could always stay here, settle down, make a new start. <laughs> Guys like me don't get second chances, darling. We just gotta finish what we've begun. You're a good man, Jim Rayner. <laughs> I ain't that good. I, I feel like you're pretty good. You risked the lives of your men to go save a colony. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's not very nice to your men, but oh well. We all know what you were going after. What's up, Tychus? Damn shame Doc Hanson stayed behind. She was just about to fall for my roguish charms, too. You ain't gonna tell me you were just a little bit tempted to stay with her, are you? I've been down that road before, Tychus. I took my shot at a normal life a long time ago. Ain't no going back now. <laughs> Couple of badasses like us ain't cut out for the quiet life anyway. Yes, sir. Destiny's got us pegged for something way bigger. Yeah, you know, Jim's more into those psychotic, murdering, psychic bitches, you know. Kerrigan, just putting that out there. Let's go rebuy our Viking mercenaries again. For the right price. Because remember, everything else that I did didn't happen actually. There we go, bought the Viking. Let's watch the news. Welcome back. We've got good and bad news tonight from our UNN headquarters on Korhal. The influx of refugees has dropped as various fringe worlders have found new planets on which to settle. For the bad news, let's go to Kate Lockwell. Kate? What? Is, is, there, is the feed open? Hi. Uh, yes. Hi, Donnie. Well, many of the refugees are starting new colonies, and they've declared themselves independent of the Dominion. They have no faith in Emperor Mengsk's leadership. Well, Donnie, they mostly seem like regular folks who were scared about the current crisis and angry that the Dominion didn't do more to save them. Some of them have praised Jim. Thanks Ray for that, Kate. <laughs> here first. Serious questions about Emperor Mansk's leadership across the fringe worlds. Can he warn me when he's going to do that? <laughs> People take it personal when you abandon them to the Zerg. Yeah, that's not like that's happened anywhere in created the most powerful creature in the universe or anything. Oh wait, Kerrigan! Again! Man, she keeps on popping up. There's nothing going on here. Stepman doesn't want to talk to me anymore. I got extra money. That's fantastic. Talk to Swan. Man, did you see the size of that Protoss ship? Don't matter how often I see him, those guys always come out with something that makes your jaw drop. You know what I'm saying? I'd be more impressed if they were using all that power against the Zerg. It's stupid to be killing Protoss when we should be teaming up with them against Kerrigan. Listen, they deserved it, and you did the right thing. Friends don't let friends massacre civilians, Jim. I'm proud of you for standing up to them. Friends don't let friends massacre civilians. That's a new one. We already talked about the Viking. Now to the Armory console. And I'm gonna upgrade, you guessed it, the Viking! That one. Why not? All the money into the Viking. I like the Viking. I use them a lot. Okay, to the bridge. Do you want to talk to me this time, Horner? No, he never wants to talk to me after this mission gets done. That's fine. I don't have to talk to him. I'm fine. Well, you know what, guys? We did it again. We beat the Haven mission again. This time doing a different timeline. We helped Hansen, and we beat the Protoss, which I'm kind of bummed about because he's right. We shouldn't be fighting the Protoss. The Protoss should be teamed up with us against the Zerg. I mean, they lost a mothership. Dang it. That's not cool. They're awesome. So you know what, guys? I'm going to call it here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll be back next time to continue the fight. I don't even know who is next. Let's actually look at the star map to see who I fight against next. Oh, no. I, I've been putting that mission off because I hate that mission. Oh, well. You'll see it next time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.